Welcome, I'm here with Matthew Moore, the president, co-founder, and CEO of Interscope. Matthew, great to be with you once again. You've joined us a few times before. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. How about yourself? Great, as always, Matt. Always a pleasure to have you here. Uh, tell me a little bit about Interscope and what the company does. Can you start us off there? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Interscope, with our subsidiaries, uh, I hear and Hearing Assist, we are a premium, affordable, direct-to-consumer hearing aid company and hearing and ear care supply company as well. So we are launching products um, on, a, on our website um, on a direct-to-consumer basis, including multiple retailers um, like Rite Aid, Best Buy, you know, even, uh, uh, even Walmart. So, I mean, um, we are, we are a, a, a trying to help the 50 million Americans suffering from hearing loss today that are not getting any assistance today. And, uh, and that is a big thing that our company, as, a, as a, I'm third generation in the hearing industry, we are all about trying to help as many people as possible. And our products can do that on an affordable level. Outstanding. And then who is your target market? Who are you guys going after with these products? Yeah, really, it crosses um, all all genders, you know, um, all races, all ethnicities, all, um, you know, um, income levels, really. But the the, mo the biggest population is around that 60 to 65 mark. Um, that is roughly, you know, over 20 million Americans that need hearing assistance that are not getting it is in that age bracket. And the primary reason is the current hearing aids that you get at a local professional office is anywhere from four to eight thousand dollars for a set of hearing aids. And ours roughly are about five to eight hundred dollars uh, a set. So and we're providing similar technology, um, similar features to the consumers at that at these price points that are 90 percent lower cost without sacrificing quality. Outstanding. And what's the potential addressable market for what Interscope is doing? Do you have a, an idea of how big this opportunity could really be? Yeah, I mean, right now it's a $5 billion industry um, in the United States alone, 10 billion um, globally. But that, that is just, that's about 98% of that is still through brick and mortar. It is less than 2% is on a direct to consumer um, uh, uh, pace. So, so that is where, where we're looking to grab um, a, a huge market share um, as with our new subsidiaries that we acquired last year um, with again, I hear and hearing assist. We are looking to grow this to 100 million, $200 million revenue business pr pretty easily um, based on our distribution strategies that we're working with multiple retailers. Outstanding. And who are your competitors in the space and what are you guys doing differently to really separate Interscope from the rest of the competition? Yeah, I mean, really, to be honest, uh, I've obviously acquired two of my competitors. Um, there's less than eight additional competitors in the market. There's actually they're, they're even falling further and further down um, as, as this goes as this goes on. Um, you know, the biggest two competitors is one is Ergo. They're on the Nasdaq um, EAR um, and then another company called Lively Hearing. Um, you know, both of our products, here's the great thing is they don't have a distribution strategy like we do, uh, like our subsidiary hearing assist with, uh, with Rite Aid, Best Buy and Walmart. They, they, they are actually um, just going to a direct to consumer basis online, um, essentially. And what the thing is though, their products are still two, 2000 to $3,000 a set. Um, so there's, yes, they're 50% lower than you would get at a lower at, at a private practice, but our products are still lower lower cost and and providing similar if not better technology compared to those competitors amazing okay and then who on your board or your management team is the industry leading expert can you talk a little bit about the team that makes up what you do yeah absolutely basically we have a team of audiologists a team of uh, licensed hearing specialists um, we also um, have my family on the board again I'm, I'm the third generation in the industry my grandfather's been doing since the 1940s we lost him uh, about a year and a half ago but up until the day he passed away he was still helping the hearing impaired um, with amplification hearing devices not but be not because he had to but because he wanted to um, so so my family we've helped over a hundred thousand um, people in the California market I mean our, our private practice was one of the largest uh, privately held uh, audiological clinics on the West Coast for many, many years. We sold that off in 2016 so we can focus on Interscope as a direct-to-consumer solution. So that way we can, um, that instead of reaching 100,000, 200,000 people, we can reach millions, not just in the United States, but globally. Outstanding. Okay, obstacles you're going to overcome over the next 12 to 18 months. Can you talk about some key takeaways that investors should be looking for when it comes to what you guys are going to do over the next year and a half? Absolutely. The biggest thing right now, we have two areas that, that is really exciting for us. One is the new over-the-counter hearing aid regulations that is cut, that's going to be enacted any day now. I mean, it's literally 
within a week to two weeks, um, it's, go it's going to be announced, these regulations, then they become effective within 60 days. This is something that my company, um, Interscope, has been working towards this the, the past five, six years. You know, it's signed into law by Trump in 2017, um, it actually started by, you know, by Obama, um, then Trump signed into law in 2017, and now it's going to become effective um, just within a matter of a, of a few weeks even. So, I mean, that is a huge takeaway. And then finally is that we're launching over 15 hundred um, product displays inside Walmart vision centers. That is the huge element. We're going to be, Walmart is actually like the top five um, auto, um, optical centers um, in America. And so we're launching over 1,500 of our product displays within Walmart right now, Walmart vision centers. And, and we're actually, we're, we have over 100 out there right now as is. Um, we should have all 1,500 out within two weeks. Our products are going to be in stores. Um, or we're going to have, uh, um, uh, you know, pro accessories, cleaning supplies, as well as um, amplification products um, um, in, in stores at Walmart locations within a matter of a few days to a few weeks. Um, and we're going to be growing this to a much bigger scale to twice that um, over the next six to 12 months. So we are we are running huge. I mean, we already have $11 million purchase order. Um, actually, we've delivered as of today, we have delivered all $11 million for the products to Walmart. So it's going to go in through their logistics chain right now, and this, this will be in Walmart locations um, nationwide within a matter of days. And, and this is just the initial order. We're looking for replenishment orders that, that is going to have a run rate of two to three times that amount easily. Amazing. Obviously, the Walmart deal, very exciting and a lot more big things to come there. Matthew Moore, president, co-founder and CEO of Interscope Hearing Technologies. Thank you once again. And as always, for being with us and sharing more about what you guys are up to. Appreciate it. Thank you so much.